The Commissioner for Environment, Kogi State Chief Victor Omofai, says the COVID-19 pandemic has caused in its trail environmental challenges and unemployment in the country. He disclosed this at a workshop organized by Environmental Media Correspondents Association of Nigeria, MCAN, in Abuja. The Commissioner therefore urged state government to ensure effective implementation of polluters' pay principle on industries as a measure to mitigate air pollution and boost revenue for states. On African countries, such as Nigeria, the COVID-19 pandemic is affecting many economic sectors. Future environmental crises, such as the unemployment, closure of markets and factories, hunger, increase in poverty levels, social violence, such as increased rate of rape cases, civil arrest, climate change, environmental degradation, increase in generation of, of waste and land graphs, among others. It is very pertinent to know that the environment is very patient and absorbs both natural and anthropogenic activities, but never forgives and gives back severely to the offender. Arguably, man through various anthropogenic activities has done more harm than good to the environment. Director General of National Biosafety Agency, Dr. Rufus Ebegba, stressed the need for relevant stakeholders' involvement in security, economy, science and technology activities to drive the new environmental sector. The activities of man will continue to tamper with the natural environment endowed us by God. And we as humans, God will equally give to us intellects, the knowledge and what it takes for us to come up with innovations that will ensure that the environment is safe for all of us. As writers, as men of pain, you must do what you need to do for the interests of your country. This administration has put in place what needs to be done to protect the citizen, to provide for the citizen, to expand the economy, to ensure farmers have better harvests, they also have income, they live normal lives like any of us. Let nobody mislead you. You as journalists, you know a lot and you can seek information. Don't use your media as a source of misinformation and also causing panic in the society. Conservator General of the National Park Service, Dr. Ibrahim Goni, pledged the willingness of the service to support MCAN when necessary to discharge its duty to ensure a healthy environment in Nigeria for sustainable livelihood of citizens. I also congratulate you for deeming it important to organize this workshop which further convinces us in the service today that you are not a member of MCAM by accident, but by passion and determination to revert the injustices to our environment. Therefore, as reliable partners in this course, I will continue to support you where necessary in discharging your noble duty to ensure healthy condition of Nigerian environment for sustainable livelihoods of its citizens. I want to also call on you to just use this workshop to come up with strong suggestions on how to further ensure the health of the Nigerian environment and beyond with your pains and otherwise as this is a responsibility that cut across our international borders.